Hi, this is Sonia from Now Stand for Fun. I hope you guys are having a great day. I want to create another Halloween manicure before Halloween is over. And this time it won't be gruesome like my last manicure, the brains. <laughs> that was a very fun and crazy manicure I did. If you guys haven't seen it, I'm going to put the link down below. But this time I'm going to create a colorful manicure, a happy manicure. We'll be using um, these skulls right here from Bunny's Nails Plate HDD. And we'll be applying different colors with a sponge. You can use any sponge you have. This sponge right here was from a set from China Glaze. It was an ombre set. And we'll be using different colors. Alright, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let me quickly go over the colors. This is the oil from China Glaze. This is this will do nicely. It'll be written down below. <laughs> then we have this beautiful green, which is grass is lime greener. This beautiful yellow, which is called sun upon my skin. And China Glaze white on white. Those will be the colors we'll be using today. Like I said before, we'll be using a a sponge to apply it to my nails and the base color I totally forgot to tell you guys the base color and this is a beautiful color from China Glaze as well where did I put the bottle sorry about that here it is it's five rules okay that's the base color and that's from the giver collection so I apply that to all my nails and now we're going to start to apply the colors. So what I am going to do is apply all these beautiful colors to the sponge. Remember, you don't need these exact colors. You can use any color you have already in your collection. So just apply dots of colors here and there because we want it to look very colorful. And I add a little bit of white. Now we're going to just sponge that on very lightly to all our nails, as you can see. Oops. Wait, let me take that off. Some cotton. All right. So as you can see how it looks. And we're going to continue to do this all over our nails. Because this is going to be our colorful colors underneath our nail stamping. So just continue to do that. Okay. To all your nails. See how that's turning out? I'm going to add some more color. You continue to add color until, well, you like what you see. You can even add more colors or change the colors, whatever you like, you guys. Let's add some green. I want some more green on there. And I think that's great like that. Now, what we have to do is add 
your favorite top coat. This is going to help blend everything and it's going to look very nice. Okay, I don't know if you can see it. I really wish I had a better quality camera. But of course you're going to see it in the picture at the end. Now we have to let that completely dry before we begin to nail stamp. Okay. Now we're going to stamp with different colors from Mundo de Uñas. If you want to and you don't have different colors to stamp with, you, you can stamp over with black and it's going to look beautiful too. So don't worry about that, you guys. Remember, if you don't have the same colors, you can use other colors and I know it's going to come out great. Let me quickly go over the colors of Mundo de Uña Polishes. This is number 4. This is number 53. This is number 15. And this is number 52. And we're going to apply all these colors over this image and stamp over our colorful nails. It's going to be a very colorful mani, you guys. Now we apply the different colors to the plate. And I really love to just apply dots here and there. Just like that. Okay, now we're going to swipe. Pick up. And stamp on our nails. Okay. And I'm going to continue to do that on all my nails. Just finished cleaning up and what I use, let me tell you guys again, is this e.l.f. concealer brush which costs me a dollar and I just take acetone and I clean around my nails, my cuticle area. So remember you guys, after you're done and your nails are dry, I totally recommend you guys to apply cuticle oil. That way it can help your nails grow and also um, give back some moisture back to your cuticles okay now we have to go to the final step which is apply your favorite top coat of course you can also apply glitter if you want to I'm not going to apply glitter this time, but of course you can. And there we go, you guys. What do you guys think? This is a cute, fun manicure for Halloween. I really like them. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Please take care and happy stamping. Bye. Bye.